First comic coming up the stage. It's his first time, y'all. Give him a hand clap for that. president who is so large, takes up so, so much space, he could represent the country itself. I'm talking about a guy, when they play Hail to the Chief, when he's making a speech, he comes out <laughs> And even that has winded him. <laughs> he's knocked the breath right out when he comes up. Oh, give, me, give me a second, ladies and gentlemen of America. Oh, all right. I'm your commander in chief. I'm your commander in chief. And uh, God, there better be catering at this thing. I am your commander in chief. And I'm going to tell you right now that I am not ashamed of my weight. Granted, they had to build a ramp up here. I couldn't take the stairs, but I'm not ashamed of it. And with that representation, with that representation, we are going to, once again, list slowly into the streets with the jazzy parade behind us, and we are going to demand what every true, honest-to-God American wants, preferential treatment. <laughs> for example, and this was the topic, God help me, for example, when somebody dies, like Paul Walker, whoever wrote this, you are an awful person. <laughs> They get preferential treatment. You can't say anything bad about them. That's all I really had to say about him. I'm honestly, boy, is that like a ton of bricks. <laughs> I, I mean, you know, it's one of those things like it hits you goes, oh, God, I don't want to say anything too offensive, but I don't know if, it'll, if, it, if I'm, it's not offensive enough. It's not going to be funny. So, couldn't do that. So, uh, I want to thank you very much for laughing at me my first time. I know it was mostly charity. Thank you very much. Uh, <laughs> 